Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to Star Renegades tonight. We got a good, solid chunk into run number two last time, so that's what we are going to start off with tonight. Everybody should be, I think, at level four. Um, we got four folks now, and most of them should be kitted out with some pretty good gear. At least for what we can afford and what we have, right? Yeah, everybody's level four. We picked up this new uh, character class, the Aegis, I guess. Um, I'm not 100% sure what her stuff is. Uh, it's mostly guarding folks, and uh, that's about it. Charging shields, um, other things, right? Because we don't really, we've only got, really got the one attack, right? The one single target normal ass attack and not really much else. Um, does she have anything on her? Oh yeah, she's got gauntlets and whatever, right? And we've got a pretty good S-word, and a couple guns there, and a gun there, and then some other implants and shit. So that that's looking good. Um, we are down to 15 buckos, that's not enough for nothing. So let's go ahead and just go to the next planet. And, and do this, and hopefully not die, but we'll see. We'll see. Okay, so we can't do whatever that one is. That's probably something you unlock after, like, a successful run. We haven't had a successful run yet. So off to Narosh. Narosh, Narosh, whatever. Um, alright, we get a little... get to do a little, uh, thing here. Well, let's do that, clearly. Let's remember the time we murdered that big fucker here? Um... <sighs> How to rob friends and raid people. <laughs> uh. Oh, man. Okay, so now we get more health and more shield damage between the two of them. I'm into that. That's that's cool. Um, any more of those free bits that we can do? No? Okay. Well, then we can do... Uh, I guess we can do that, since that's only one bit, plus that'll get them to be level one friends, I suppose. So more health and more stagger. Excellent. Um, more shield damage wouldn't be bad. That costs three, though. Uh, so what else do we have? We've got two. Uh, faster attack speed. Um, yeah, sure. All right. And then we've got two more points left, which we can pretty much just do one of these. Do we have, a, like, another single point? Okay, it's just heals. I don't care about heals. I guess the only thing I would care about for this would be the four relationship points, right? Um, but I don't care that much about it, so let's do uh, shield drain. Which is good. That's good for our front runner, honestly. She'll be doing most of the attack. Alright. Here we are, eventually, on Roche, right? There we go. Oh, no, that's right, we get to learn about the... about the Dingleberries first here. Um, which I'm not gonna care about. Okay, we got a level 5, and a level 5. A level six, and a level six, so yeah, not really beyond the pale, are they? Okay, well, let's uh, engineer this such that we fight them whilst we're at full power, and probably be fine. Okay, two shielder dipshits, huh? And there, there's our primary objective in the center there. Okay, so what do we have to put here? Um, a free armor thing. There's the health thing over there. Level 4 thing there. Level 4 thing there. Level 4. Okay, so it looks like all the basic bitches are going to be level 4, right? It's just the uh, larger dudes that are level 5 or level 6, right? So, okay. You can go into the... Right doesn't yield anything, but we get a shield and more money. Also, a, probably a small fight there, and might be able to go in there. Who knows? 
Um, so that'll be one. And then two over here for extra money and a fight. And then three up here to fight Ooh, level six right away, huh? Maybe we don't want to do that. Because then maybe we want to go, oh, I don't know, second day. One, two, three. And then we can worry about, like, one, uh, two, three, well, three here, I guess. What happens if we do go around this other way, though? Because I don't like that there's no fight here. Really. So if we go around this way, we could fight the level 5 dipshit first. There's also an extra DNA thing there. And I thought there was another. Okay, there was a healy bit over here. So, okay, you know what? Let's go over this way. We'll so have that armor repair just kind of hanging out. Um, I actually probably prefer to go over here to unlock the. The free heal a bits, right? Sure, right. Four on four, no problem. Four on four, and most folks are gonna. Oh, she's got a shield back too. Is that a range thing to hit anything? Okay. That's a not unreasonable amount of stagger, but it's very, very late, um, apparently. So let's not do that. Uh, instead. God, I really wish I had actual AoE thing. So, but I have to worry about any of these guys. Nitro damage, nitro damage, concussion damage, nothing. Okay. Okay, so we can only attack the front two with that guy. We do. Also can only attack the front two with that guy. I don't have to be the back two here, huh? Right? There's no guarantee I would, uh... Stop anything from happening here. It looks like they're mostly focused on my aid, which is fine, I guess. Because, uh... Like, she's the shield, right? essentially our tank, except for other frontliner, right? Um, okay, so what can we do with her then? She can only attack the front two as well, unless we do this, right? Or, we can just use her to do guard stuff. Or, deflect, uh, which reflects 25% damage, and since they're all pretty much attacking her anyways, Um, she'll be taking only half damage, pretty much. Uh, okay. That's, that's cool and good. Um, what else can we do to these other fuckers? Like, maybe set that up and be like, oh yeah, let's make sure you go away first, actually. Bonk. It doesn't do much damage, um, but it gets him off the timeline, which is important. Um, and then there's this one, which is effectively, hey, just do that, get rid of him. And then when they fire on my Aegis, they take, what, quarter of the damage they're putting out? So, you know what? I'm into that. Nice hit. And then I think one of them shoots at... Yeah, one of them shoots at her. She's got the shields. She can take it. Okay. Not terrible. Not terrible at all. Um... and do effectively the same thing. <laughs> effectively the same round of attacks will uh, save us from most of this stuff, right? So, what are they? so now they're all attacking her. Um, if I were to then... Deflect would save her for, from almost all the damage again, which is even better. So, let's do that. And then, let's probably do the same thing here. Kill shot that 
dummy, and then pretty much the other same stuff here, too. And then we just gotta deal with one dude making a move here. He's also bleeding, which is great. There goes that fucko. Off the timeline again, and he's burning. And also bleeding, I think. Uh, this guy should be just toast outright, yeah? Excellent. Now he'll fire and take a little bit of damage. That's fine. And now we're kind of back to this, right? So at this point, we can just be like, boom, bam. Two murderous kills right away, right? Uh, let's do... Sure, he goes first, right? He's out of there first. And then our... Sure that he goes, right? And I think... Well, and we've just got that dude in the back, really. Uh, which will do very little damage. Uh, we could just do a stun and make sure, right? Otherwise, we've got this. She'll just break him off the timeline anyway, so that's actually pretty good. And then whatever else we kind of do here. Uh, because I imagine whoever goes first here is gonna... Murder one of these things, right? And he should retarget for the last remaining one. That's, that's my hope, anyway, so... Bye-bye, eat shit there. Bye-bye, eat shit there. I'm hoping this guy eats the attack there, okay. So that, um... Uh, fell to him correctly, and then we're gonna go bam Which, yeah, light damage, but whatever. And now it's whoever gets the kill gets the kill. It's gonna be whoever goes first. It's probably gonna be my front pro tag, huh? Yeah, eat shit, there we go. So perfect, just a bunch of, bunch of shield damage, which doesn't make any difference anyways, since we get healed up all the time. Um, okay, we've got one additional thing we can do, so we can get some food if we need to. That's a little really lightweight dude, or there's a thing over there. Also a lightweight dude. That's gonna be locked down anyway, so... Might be better off just doing this one. So that'll lead us to then, uh, one... Two, this is level five, which is fine, and then three, we could probably come back here. Eventually. Because I'd really like to go over here. Alright, well. Try to do our best here. Oh, we can do a level up, too. Who gets the level up? Does anybody get the level up? Okay, uh, we've got just enough for three folks, huh? Hmm. Well, what does all this get? Oh, it's all, like, the in-between stuff. It's really just not particularly helpful during battle right now, but... Ugh, these cables are really pissing me off. Um, and otherwise it's going to be health. Otherwise it's going to be health, which is, um, 18, 33, 25. Health really hasn't been a concern. Um, so we should probably look ahead to maybe... Uh, a possible better equipment that they could use, so I guess we'll start with our Protag, right? She gets a health boost. She can use level 5 stuff eventually. 
then we'll worry about the rest later. Alright, what do we got here? No, oh, it's four on three. I like this odds. Let's see. Charge. It's, oh. Oh, it's a free action. But it does use fury. That's kind of silly, actually. <laughs> kind of a little silly. Alright. Uh, well. Probably guarantee that at least one of these fucks dies. We do all that, we push them all back. Well, maybe not. Okay, maybe we... let's see. Sorry. Um, I need to stop doing that. So then I'm gonna need to do this probably first. That'll get him off the timeline entirely, so I don't have to worry about him, right? Anybody else attack? I think so, right? No, he's going after that guy. Okay, so we can at least make him a non-worrisome participant here. Um, and then... I just ensure that that guy goes the fuck away. That's just a one and done, essentially, right? And then... Well, I think he's toast to begin with, right? So there he goes. He's off the off the timeline here. No problem. He's also on fire. Great. Bonk. Pretty good hit. Um, and then this guy's just straight up toast, right? It's a one shot. Good. And now it's more or less just uh, murder some things. That, uh, that guy also now becomes a non issue. Uh, I should be able to maybe attack this frontline dude such a way that he'll be dead, maybe. But even if not, I mean, he's attacking our frontliner and it's not going to be an issue anyway. No, nope. okay, they'll both be dead. <laughs> so, two rounds and done. Two rounds and toast, and I bet the, uh, the loot from this will be pretty light, considering it was a very non threatening battle. Okay, just a little bit of extra level up juice. A bit of extra money. More? Not really. That area's locked down, so we can't do it. That area's about to be locked down tomorrow. And then the rest is kind of over that way anyway, so, okay. Either way, good first day. Um, all right. Wait, wasn't there? Okay, yeah, here is this one. 30 max shields to everybody, uh, which I quite enjoy. That's great. Do that. Um, but then that means we only have, like, one, one thing we can do otherwise, unless we do, unless we try to split this up, right? Shield defense plus 10%. And then I guess this, yeah, might be worth it, in fact. Let's split it up a bit. And then the other one popper is this one, really, which heals. 
but I don't really care about the heals. I just want the shield defense. Um, and if our Aegis is going to be taking most of the hits anyways, may as well give her the shield defense. Okay. Dawn of the second day. Uh, Alright. Well, that's pretty much a dead end there. But then we can go up here and murder that one real quick. We've got a level 5 here. Which is, uh... Would be a tougher battle, but probably not undoable. And we can unlock shit, which would put, uh... Two here? No. Be number three here, probably. Is this the level six idiot over here? Yeah, it's okay. Where's the other, like, bigger boy? This one? Okay. Yeah, we'll have to wait to unlock stuff before we go out. Do that guy. Uh, alright. Seems fine, I guess. Seems like a reasonable enough plan. First couple battles would be pretty easy. At least this one will be, because it's four on three. Okay, that dude gets to do whatever guarding shit that he's doing. Whatever, don't care. Um... Uh, be like, okay, I don't care about this guy getting to go right away, so fuck you. We're maxed out on Fury, so we may as well do some of it if we can, if it would make sense to do so. Two versus 35. 105% damage against. Oh, shield. Both are 105% damage against shields. The gen then just work down this other fucker. So I think who's he targeting? He's targeting. He's targeting my back row guy. Uh, that's interesting, sir. So if that's the case. Oops, I already did my thing with him. Then I guess big boot slam that'll almost get rid of him. Alternatively, I could just get rid of this guy, which might make more sense. Or I could. Oh no, he's getting guarded by that guy, anyways. All right, you know what? Let's remove one of these fuckers from the field entirely. Not have to worry about him, then it becomes four on two. Even more in my favor. So yeah, he's gonna get all of his shield and a little tiny bit of health. Whatever, don't care. And now it might make sense to be like, oh yeah, let's make sure we murder this one super hard. Then we can work on... I don't know. Just gonna bop him off the timeline and then work him down, I guess? Yeah, because it's already at, like, almost half health. Make sure he gets out of there entirely, and then this will be a kill shot on him anyways. Good. And then we can do, I don't know, Big Boom Slam against that guy. He's probably going to die from that, so whatever. This will push us almost back to Max Fury the way it is. Yeah, he's toast. So, done in two rounds yet again. Do another level up before we do the next... That tool over here against this fucker, I guess, huh? So who gets it this time? Maybe our other front runner. Got two level fives and two level fours against this level five dipshit, whoever else he's got with them. So 
Seems fine. Let's do it. Also get some equips out of the deal too. Oh yeah, this looks a little meaner. I don't like it. <laughs> and I don't have any AoE attacks. That's what makes me a little annoyed by all this. So who's attacking who? Okay, they're all attacking uh, Frontliner except for this one. So maybe we do Deflect. Or maybe we worry about... Of course, I can't attack the dude way in the back. He is getting guarded by all of his other dipshit friends. What else does he have? He doesn't like being debuffed. He's weak against heavy attacks, though. Oh, and he's got regenerating shields. Oh, gross. Alright, well... Work the problem, I guess, right? the problem, make sure he gets off the timeline entirely. So we're good there. And then really just have a maybe a deflect situation, because he's the only one that's going to be able to go. So we may as well be just like, yeah, let's do that, and then we can worry about... Wait, who's... Okay, you're attacking him. Are you taking him off the timeline? Yes, okay, but we've still got this guy here, which worries me a little bit, so it's all right, let's keep that, then can she go, okay, she'll go with enough time to be like, all right, may as well just take him off the timeline, really, because that's going to be 100% kill shot, yeah, and it'll be four on three, better numbers. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Oh, but he didn't take any of that damage, so... As long as she took reduced damage, that's fine, too. Okay, now it's four on three. that he goes absolutely last. Still can't get to the dude in the back. They're really taking it to my uh, frontliner there. So if we guarantee that he goes pretty much last, right? Seems like a good opening play. Then we can worry about some other things. Um, maybe we can even get... Okay, no, that's not going to be enough. To go slightly before her. Oh, I hate it. Okay. Okay, we can make sure that he doesn't get to go. What else do I have? I've got armor piercing. Does anybody have any armor? Oh, just that dude. It's four armor. Fuck do. Don't care that much about it. Um, okay. Is he attacking? Oh, her. Okay. Um. I could remove one more of these fuckers. Maybe that guy first. Have her deflect, she'll save most of her stuff. And I can make sure that he is not going this turn either. I would maybe prefer to get this guy. He's not gonna die. But he's already isn't he already off the time? I think he's already gonna be put off the timeline, right? Yeah.
so I'd be best off maybe doing big boot slam here. Getting him to near death. Okay, good. Her armor saved her there. He's pretty much almost nearly dead. Alright, and he's guarding because he's a fucking coward. Uh, but that gives us a, a goodly amount of time to work these fuckers down. So if we do boom, and... Okay, that's a little bit too slow. Wish I had some AoE attacks here, but I don't. Oh, he's guarding that guy. That's fine. Okay, that's fine. Um, who is he attack? My front runner. All right, that'll be fine too then. Um, yeah, I'll have to do this. Focus down, focus down, and then I don't know. Just a big old smash. Or I could be like, uh, let's charge, or let's guard somebody. Oh, we probably should, on account of her shields are not looking great. So let's just give her a, give her an attack against something, I guess. That guy? He's gonna get to go no matter what, but at least do as much as we can against him. So I think he's okay. So he's not quite toast. But he's toast here. So fuck that guy. Then we get one bonk there, and he gets to go. This is a very small amount of damage. All right, we got pretty much, uh, pretty much nothing. Pretty much nothing here. And what, what, what does he got? Vengeful stance. What does that mean? Counterattacks. Okay, well, he's got to make sure that whatever hits him kills him. So he can't counter at all. So, there. That'll pretty much do him in. Alright. Then we can focus down this guy. Well, that'll go after the kill shot, anyways, so that's fine. Really would prefer to. Really not hit him otherwise. I guess I can plant explosives. Yeah. Because who's he attacking? Attack my front runner again, but that's just her shield. But she'll be alright. Just plant explosives then. It's so, alright, he's toast. Every other attack is now gonna go bonk. And then big boot slam here. Should knock him off the timeline, anyways, right? Yeah, nice. Nice shot. Now he's gonna get to go or do whatever, but I don't think it's gonna matter. <laughs> because he's gonna get toasted anyways. Um, and this is the only AoE attack I have. It's just kind of silly. But that's gonna be mostly him kaboom bam boom. Like a good solid hit. That does eat his turn though, which sucks, but what do you gonna do? So if I do that, then I do, I don't know, smash, I guess, and then I do broadside. He's gonna fucking die no matter what. Bonk! Bye bye armor, idiot. And bonk! Bye bye 21 health, and then kill shot. All right, pretty good. Only budget Han Solo really took a very small tap there. Everybody else is fine. No, but, but he didn't have any regrets because he was toast to begin with. All right, so then is this the level six dude? That's the level six dude. We might be in a good position to to get him. So we're still mostly. Uh, 
mostly bad, like at full health and shit. Um, a better S word. We've already got better gauntlets there, so that's kind of out. 20% damage versus health on counterattacks, which uh, might be good for our our frontline shielder. She does reflect damage. Does that count as a counterattack? But also a health shield, which is fucking great. Um, so that's probably going to be it regardless. I don't think that we want this S-word. We already got a good S-word that does health steal. And does just general damage buff. So uh, let's take this and we'll give it to our frontliner there. Um, does she? Okay, that replaced her other thing. What was the other thing that she had? Oh, just a damage booster. Um, eh, whatever. Can we give that to somebody else then? Yeah, we can give that damage booster to our other frontliner. Um, and we just got nothing else for nobody, huh? All right. So who can level up now? Either of our other ones, which is really just, uh... oh, nice. Honestly, armor, defense, and crit damage boost, pretty good. Attack speed's pretty good. The level ups aren't that great here. It almost just wait for additional stuff to to upgrade our folks there, but you know what? I don't mind having like the levels balanced, you know? Balancing levels seems like a good idea. Alright, that leaves uh one choice here. So let's unlock all those, right? So we could then start working our way down here. It would be one for the final bit this day. I want to save one to go kick this guy's ass first. So that's probably a final day bit. So one, uh, two, three. Oh man, there's this little tiny one over here though. I'd really like to go kill this guy too, but... Well, this kind of stinks. I don't have enough time to do everything that I want to do. But I feel like we'll do this guy. Maybe at the... Uh, first action of day three, right? When everybody's charged up and ready to go. Level six is still a bit concerning. Um, but then we can burn our last step here on this guy. Should be a pretty soft touch of a battle. Hey, Gamer, how you doing? Good to see ya. Um, we've had a pretty successful second area so far. Nobody's really hurt in any sort of way. Picked up some good gear. Had some good fights. Uh, oh, jeez, that guy gets to go first. Thanks for that. Uh, but that's fine. We should be fine. Um, let's see what we can do about this. Uh, that guy can go, go away, probably, immediately. Uh, I really wish I could... Can anybody hit... Alright, let's cancel all. Can anybody hit the back row there? Yeah, we can do that, but that doesn't do anything. Oh, because it goes late. That's... And I don't know what it's doing. What does recalibration do? Nothing. Does nothing. So it's essentially free check. Don't have to worry about the dude uh, in the back. He seems like he's not going to be an issue. So let's see. Let's push that guy out of here immediately. Um, and then, we can be like, oh, let's get rid of, uh, 
this one? Yeah. Push him off the timeline. Then we get, like, the ability to push him off the timeline. And now we get essentially a free turn to... Oh, I don't know. Let's get rid of... Uh... It's either of these two, yeah? Let's get rid of the front dude. Or actually, no, this dude's got all the armor, so let's get rid of him. Seems good. Bonk. Get out of here, fucking idiot. Um, and he's on fire, too, which is even better. Uh, get, get you off the timeline, fuck you. That guy gets to go, I don't know what he's doing, whatever. Doesn't matter. And then that guy's toast, so... All good. All good, all good. And I don't know what he's doing. Empowered? Oh shit, he gets to... That makes him faster, that sucks. But, you know, our frontliner... It, and just take it, because he's got so much shield. Uh, alright. So, and then, let's, I guess get that guy off the timeline again. Because <laughs> fuck him. He doesn't get to go. Um, and then we've got plenty of time to just fucking do an extreme murder, essentially. Alright, so that guy's fucking toast. Uh... Can we maybe just make this guy toast as well? And then also, oh, that's not gonna murder him outright, but that's fine. Probably. Yeah, I mean, he'll be easy pickings next round. All right, so that fucker's gone. Now it's four on two. I don't know what this guy thinks he's gonna do. Mitigate defense. I don't know what the- Ow! Hey! Okay, that's... Um, doesn't matter, because <laughs> everything's gonna die. Uh, that guy's gonna die, and then we can probably just... Well, he's gonna die before she does the big boom slam anyway, so dude in the back is really gonna eat it. Um, same with whatever that's gonna happen, and then same with this, so... All the attacks going against him are gonna fall back to... Dude in the back, this fucking post. So I'd be shocked if, uh. If we even got to Big Boom Slam from Protag here. Oh, now she gets the final hit. Very good. No kill like overkill. There we go. Excellent. A little tiny bit of DNA, and then we have a little bit of this. Not quite enough for an actual level up. Ooh, there's some up there, though. I'd like to see that. That might push us over, in fact. It does. Who is the only one not at level 5? Oh, Budget Han Solo. Oh, here you go, buddy. He burned it. He actually has her. He's been doing a lot of work. Um, and just in time for our camp out until day 3, really. And we'll have three choices to make. Okay. Uh, well, actually, firstly, is there anything um, else extra here? We can't get down to that one just yet. I think all the other stuff we gathered on the previous night. Yep, we're good. Everything's fine. All right. Let's have a, have a little tiny camp out. Uh, okay, well, <laughs> remember when we murdered that guy just like two minutes ago? Yeah, sure do. Um, anybody else have that? No, huh? Okay. Sure. Armor defense plus 10 and crit damage plus 25. I like that. That a lot. That's only, what, two? We got five points to use. Where's our other... Yeah, here. The Max Shields one is fucking great. I do like that a lot. I mean, it's a very small amount of relationship points to it, but it does seem... That, that'd be a good one to save maybe for uh, the final camp out before we fight the big bad, honestly. Um, so let's do... Let's try to do, like, mostly folks being cool with each other. And then, uh, do we have any, like, 
one on one here. Yeah, here. Try to make this work here between the two of them. Not quite enough yet, huh? Health damage? Seems good. Here. Here's the big one. Um. Alright, I'm. Um, Probably try to work these up to at least relationship level two, because that's when we get the big combo attacks. And I do like those. Um, so let's try between these two, I guess. It's, uh, usually those two do a lot of damage. Alright, Dawn of the Third Day. Um... So I guess the, the, the biggest play we can make now, since we've got full fury and everybody's charged and ready to go, is to go fucking murder this guy. Um, because that gets us more equipment. And probably puts us in range of this guy too, huh, right? One, two, three. Yeah, we can go get that guy. Uh, the alternative is to go two, three here. I'm not gonna do that, because I want to get rid of all these big fuckers, right? Get lots of level up juice, and uh, generally better stuff, right? So let's, let's go take care of this fucker. Okay, it's four on three already, in our favor. Oh, I don't like that he's targeting one of my back row dudes. That seems ill-advised to them. Uh, what else we got going on here? Oh, they're not even doing that. Okay, uh, cool. They've got AoE attacks. I hate it. Okay, what can we do to not have that be a thing? I could open up with my stun. That'd probably be bad. It's bad to like just burn our stun immediately. But considering that's gonna do, like, serious damage. Well, I could guard him. Or I could deflect. But let's see what else. What are our other options here? We could, uh. Okay, I could put him back, essentially. Got, uh. God, the front. The frontliner is pretty much the only one I can target with most of these. Which I do not like. Okay, what else can we target here? Ah, we can break him off the timeline like this. That makes me happy. Okay. Ah. Okay. Well, I think this dude's gonna get a get a go. And he's gonna be able to go. I don't like that. Um, but you know, if we have to, we have to. Uh, I really want this guy off the timeline here. Even if it only damages his shield. So let's get that kind of sorted. Uh, actually, no. I changed my mind. <clears throat> Inspired recently to try and learn how to make a game. You got a box that can move on ground and double drop. Hey, there you go. Nice. You gotta start. That's the important bit. You know, it's always the hardest to get started, and oh, then the hardest, the next hardest is to finish, really. <laughs> that's uh, what I've learned about most things that I've done, at, at the very least. So, that's good. That's good to hear. Good luck with what you're doing there. Um, God, I really can't attack that other dude with anything else, huh? Well, besides her, I guess, I can make sure that yeah, he goes the fuck away. And also that this guy moves back. Uh, you know what? No, let's make sure that he goes away. And that'll reduce most of everything else. Uh, wait, who is she attacking? She's attacking uh, big dude there, right? Okay. Um, really want to get that lower dude to not fire at her before she gets to go. But I don't think I'm going to have that opportunity here, am I? But, either way, I think this frontliner is probably fucking toast. 
so I may as well just make sure he becomes toast. And then... Yeah, let's just make sure he becomes toast. Because then, big dude in the middle gets shoved off the timeline, nobody gets a crit on our Aegis character there. And then we're ready. We're ready to go. Like, boom, bam, boom. Eat shit. You don't get to go this turn. Fuck you. Um, and then, boom. You don't get to go at all. Forever. Because you're dead. Uh, well, not yet. Uh, next hit on you will be dead. And then, boom. Okay, yeah, whatever. 53. She can take it. And then, boom. Now you're dead. Fuck you. <laughs> Alright, so now that should open up all sorts of things that we can do here. Uh, the most important of which is gonna be, yeah, fuck you, you get to not attack. Well, not yet, I guess. So wait, what is that gonna move back to? Okay, if we do that, and then we do like a, a slash? I guess it'll have to be a slash, right? That'll be 25 plus half C's on this. Yeah, that should be enough. And then, well, you know what? Unless I just do the stun immediately here. Do the stun that'll let us get back our 15 fury when we pound the rest out of here, right? Seems to be the thing to do. So, all right, he doesn't get to go. Fuck him. We get another turn to think about our stuff. Um, then we can do like, oh yeah, you get to not do anything there. This guy gets to get pushed back again, and then we make sure we we get one more. Okay, we get one more turn here. So why don't we just remove this fucker from the from the field? It's not gonna happen here, but should be pretty close. He'll be nearly dead. Big boom slam. Boom bam. Bam. Nice. Okay. And a bit of bleeding. And everything goes there. And then Haymaker, huh? Okay, that'll do a little bit of something. But I have a feeling we'll be able to make sure that it doesn't anything there. Okay. We get one chance to move him off. And honestly, I think we can take whatever he's gonna dish out here, so... Realistically... We just ensure that whatever is gonna happen to him happens before he gets to go, like a big heavy attack, boom, bam, boom, um, and then just make sure that this guy dies before anything else happens. Because who's he attacking? He's attacking my person up here, so I may as well just do deflect, and then ensure that this guy goes the fuck away anyway, so we're good there. Boom, so he goes away. Fuck him. Oh, damn. That's a bad way to go. And then kaboom. Good shot there. And then big boom slam here. Nice. 138. I'd like to see that. And he gets to go. Whatever. But, oh, oh, only two fucking health damage. I think we'll manage. Um, and now we get to pretty much just lay into him. So I'm into this. So big boom slam there. Uh, strongest attack we've got there. And I guess strongest attack we've got there. Which isn't much, necessarily. But, oh, is that gonna... That's a normal. I have a feeling he might get to go here. Because... Well, let's back up that. So that does 25, and then this is gonna do 30. Okay, no, that'll, that'll be fine. So he goes first, 
That already pushed, like, one single attack pushed them off. Okay, so I was worried for no reason. So, biggest attacks we got. Um, but I will also... Yeah, I guess I'll just have her attack, too. And then big boot slam there, and then he gets to go... Actually, no, wait. Because she gets to go before most other folks here. That already pushes them off, right? Is that what I'm worried about? No, just to be sure. Just to be sure, I don't want to make a dumb fuck-up like I did at the end of last run. So, boom. Okay, that broke him off. The first attack broke him off this turn anyway, so whatever. No problem. Just do that, and then he's on fire, and then big boom slam, and I think he's also bleeding and also on fire again. Um, and now we get to just throw everything at him the way it is. So, boom, 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 kill shot there, and boom. Yeah, everybody gets to participate in this one, I think. Oh, well, maybe not, actually. Um, because this might murder him. Yep, probably. Oh no, never mind. We get, uh, Protag to get the, the kill here. Very good. Boom, alright, that fight, no problem. Zero issues. That's what you like to see. Now he's toast. I just gotta go murder that other guy. Um, okay. And we also get this, which is gonna be... Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. A slightly... Oh, and then there's this, which is even better. Uh... It's not a health stealer, but it steals armor. Oh. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That seems real tasty. Yeah, I'll take it. Fucking take it. Um, she's not level 6, though. So, one more fight, then she'll be able to get up to level 6 and actually use that thing. So, I'm into that. Okay. Then, we've got, what, two actions, right? Yeah, okay. This dude here, and then... Yeah, that's probably the best we got. This dude there, and then this dude here. Which will be a slightly more troublesome fight, but I think we'll be able to manage. There's nothing else of value around here, I think, because we got this free armor booster, and then also a free health booster over there. We should go back and do this one too, but we'll be out of time. That's alright. Oh no, not our 25 shields. When it's gonna be four on three anyways. Okay. Well, I'm not really worried about any of this, so let's see what we can do. That guy gets the fuck out of here immediately. Uh, it's gonna be a real late hit. I don't like that. Really? Only attack the frontliner? Come on. <laughs> There we go. Let's make sure that he goes away. Um, really not? Wow, that frontline dude is like seriously standing in the way of everything. I hate it. Um, okay, fine. You know what? Fucking fine. Okay, now we can do it like this too. Can we get something dead here, or... Oh, there's gonna be an AoE, so yeah, let's make sure we can do that. There we go. So, there, there that guy goes. Fuck you. See you next turn, maybe. Um, and boom, there. Shields down, he's off of this turn, and then... Also on fire, which is great. And then boom, eat shit. You're off of this turn, too. 
Ah, uh, now it's gonna depend on who needs to get fucked first here. If we do this, it does some serious damage all around. But, uh. Yeah, we don't have folks that can move fast enough to do this, so we, maybe we wait for the next. Oh god, that's the only one we can target, too. No! <laughs> Damn it! Ah, uh, well, I guess one of them gets to go, huh? Yeesh, that's a hell of a go, though. So maybe instead I guard... Budget Han Solo, yeah? Because then at least he's not taking any health damage. Even with the AoE strike about to happen. So then we can worry about, oh, I don't know, really anything else here. So maybe it would be best to just be like, bim boom bam, do the thing so he doesn't get crit out of existence. Yeah, let's do it, fuck it. Boom. One, one of 13 across everything is pretty good. I'd like to see that. All right, and then we've got a, you know, a kill shot there. And then, I guess a kill shot on the next dude, probably. Or we could maybe guarantee that he's gonna get killed. Because who's... No, it's this dude up front that's gonna go first. That annoys me. Oh, but he's gonna be dead. So that's fine. So maybe we can... do the stronger bit. And he'll get to go anyway. It's alright. Then we're, we're fine. Everything's good. This should be fine, because now he's fucking murdered. Uh, big dude gets to do his AoE, which whatever. Everybody guards, essentially. Gets the attack there. Boom, eat shit. Right there. Yeah, everything's fine. Okay. Ooh, that guy gets to go first, though. Uh, let's make sure that he does not. <laughs> okay, let's push him back a little bit, huh? Boom. You don't get to go first. Fuck you. Now we get to decide how to do this. He gets broken off the timeline there. Uh, that's probably going to be a kill shot there regardless. Let's see what we can do, actually. That'll be a kill shot there. And then we can do... Boom. All right. Done in three. Bonk. 107, pretty good hit for our not like main damage dealer. Big boot slam, 172. Woo -hoo -hoo. Excellent. All right, kaboom! Wow, he just fucking evaporates. I love it. All right, that should be enough uh, level up juice then for our pro tag to be able to use that even better S word, right? Hmm like to see that. <laughs> That's real good. Okay. I like it. We got one more. Which will have to be this guy, I guess, right? That'll be more equips. More equips, and then probably a pretty soft touch of a battle at this point. Oh no, it's four on four. Okay. All right, I don't like him going first, but he all he's doing is, oh, that's a pretty big hit. Oh, they're all focusing on her, pretty much, right? So if I were to do, oh, that would then put her into a precarious position, <laughs> even though that's what she's there to take hits, pretty much. But if we think about this as the last action of day three here, right? We'll get full armor restore and full health. Like, oh no. 
Uh, somebody's... One of them's doing that. Okay, so if we do, like, a deflect here... That's probably good. It'll take it on the nose a little bit, but it'll be fine. Um, Alright, so then what's our, what's our go here? Get that guy all the way to the back. So I don't have to worry about whatever action I take. We could even probably do a big boom slam and get him out of there entirely, right? Almost. Almost. Um, but in the meantime, let's make sure that this guy doesn't get to fucking go. Right? <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, gross. <laughs> um, and then we've got one more choice to make here. Uh, oh, we can't get him off the timeline entirely, can we? But we can probably be like, uh, this guy goes the fuck away entirely. Right? That seems good, honestly. Alright, takes the hit, it's fine, whatever, and boom, and reflected, I resisted the reflect, great, thanks. And boom, that guy goes the fuck away, armor absorbed, which is pretty sick, didn't need it, but whatever. Then, well, shield's down there, it's fine. Got a little bit of shield regen, the way it is, it's fucking cool as hell. Okay, then... We get to go, like, oh, I don't know, uh... We have to push this guy entirely out. What's Shield Slam gonna do there? Pretty much nothing, right? Maybe a little bit of something if he gets to go before she does. But we can go for him just by doing this, essentially, right? Push him off the timeline. Uh... Let's see what else we can do here. Actually, wait, is she attacking? That guy up there, does that matter? I don't think it does, right? We would need to push somebody else out of here. Probably him. There we go. Sells a little bit of time to think, right? And then that dude, the shield slam dude's gonna get to go fucking whatever, don't care. Let's work that guy down, I think, and then... Do whatever. Bonk. Let's go first so she doesn't get crit. He needs to go. Oh no, nine shield. Oh, whatever shall we do? Um She has to go bim boom bam. Pretty good stuff there. And one more big a big shot there, yeah. 85 is pretty good. They're all on fire and bleeding shit, too, so that's even better. Uh, okay. Make sure... He's guarding that guy up there. That's a fucking mistake, but whatever. Just make sure that that guy gets off this timeline. Because uh, who's he attacking? He's attacking her. She'll take that no problem because, you know, shields and stuff. May as well just make sure that guy goes the fuck away. That guy will take a hit there, and then we'll do... Slam there. Easy, no problem, and then this guy's toast. Right? And then it's four on two. <laughs> oh no! Not my 88 shield! 
the precise amount of shield I had. Um, okay, and now we get to just make sure... Ah, uh, can't do that, huh? Damn, what is, who is he attacking? Okay, well that's not gonna do anything, hardly. Or I could do this. Ah, what's the point? You just make sure this guy dies. <laughs> make sure this guy dies super hard, and then um, just big boom slam the rest. Because she'll... Protag will take the hit. She'll lose shield, that's it. Which makes no sense. Oh, and a little bit of health. But that's fine, I think she's got health absorb... Uh, health steal the way. Oh, not anymore. She got the, the, the big, the bigger uh, S word, the fever that does help, uh, armor steal. I think instead. But that's fine. I think we'll have a full health refill before uh, boss fight anyway. <clears throat> I don't know if this will kill. Yeah, well, never mind. He's gone. Excellent. Um, is that gonna be enough to get her to level? Six. Or did we already do that? No, she's already using the, the good sword, right? The good S word. So this level up will be for somebody else. Oh, should have done the level up first. Oh, well. Ooh. Faster, better damage against shields, and a health steal, huh? I am pretty into that. Hmm. Pretty into these gauntlets. Uh. Yeah, like that's great. That's super good. Gimme. Gimme. No question. No question on that. Uh, nobody can level up. And this is our last camp opportunity. So let's go get the armor buff and the uh, health boost there. And we'll be ready. Ready to go. Ready to face the big bad. It shouldn't be that much of a of a problem, really. Um, who gets the most armor here? I guess one of our front runners, right? Probably our Aegis, I imagine. And here's our health refill. Whee! Um, and then we can focus our campouts on buffs and shit, because, uh, we don't really need to heal anything. Oops, that's the way. Anything else fresh, right? Left those two alive, which is fine, and then we're just kind of up here. Okay. What would be best here? Oh, we've got two freebies. Let's do it. Won't get him the level two relationship status for a good combo, but that's a free level one. Uh, extra health and extra shields. Perfect. Good. Great. Um, are we close to level two with anybody? Not... Oh, okay. Almost there. Um, what was their combo? That was a stun combo, right? Because that might be worth it. Especially as we head into, uh... Whatever. There's also this, and then there's also kind of an unknown combo between these two. Attack speed might be good, too. Honestly. Yeah, because I think between these... You know, I'm, I'm interested in whatever their combo is going to be. Uh, assuming that's going to be attainable. Ah, oh, it's not! Boo! Crap. 
Well, we could do the armor repair just for the relationship stuff. Which, uh, eh, might not be a bad idea, honestly. Ah, I'm annoyed by that. But I am interested in whatever the combo is going to be, so... Let's see what we can do here. I don't need the armor buff, but I don't think I have any... Oh, I got this, though. So we might want to do it this way instead. Uh, shield defense. Okay, that makes more sense. Alright, what's their combo attack gonna be? <laughs> Space Mutineer, Asteroid Thief, Master Criminal, Street Magician. That sounds lame. <laughs> Alright, what do we get? Wreck. Um, 105 plus 68. Single target, which is kind of a bummer, but does pretty good armor break and pierces 25% armor and good damage against shield. Not bad. Not bad at all, and it does reduce defense and the burning tree. Okay. Not unreasonable. Not unreasonable. Alright, time to face the big bad, though, huh? Huh. We've done this before, though. This one's... Not really that bad, is it? We'll, we'll manage. I think we'll manage. Uh, you know, let's check out what he is first, right? What are we facing? Uh, this one? Right, yeah, that's... Uh, stun goes rev and retaliates. Okay, so doesn't like stuns, can attack twice per round, sucks ass. But I think it's just going to be four on one, so that might be fine. And quarter defense against staggers. Uh, okay. Well, we'll see what we can do. Since this is final battle of this area, we can go all out. Don't have to worry about nothing. Oh yeah, okay, four on one. Oh, I don't like that. Got a lot of armor, too. Got a lot of armor. Um, okay. 30? It's not enough. 50 might be enough. Uh, but we should make sure that we are doing the best we can on an armor break. So probably sever. No. Sunder. That's 11 armor break. Hmm. Oh, but it returns three armor, huh? Oh, right, because she's got the armor absorb thing going on. Why does that only do... Oh, probably because the shield absorbs some of it, huh? Alright, well, we'll see. Got 11 armor break there, which seems good. And this is just two armor break there, which is less impressive, but probably good enough. He gets to go first, so that'll push him off entirely. Alright. Okay, good stuff there. 40 fucking health steal is great as hell. There's uh, two armor break there, fine, whatever. And then, you know, whatever there. Three armor steal, I guess. I'm surprised that didn't do any further armor break. And now we get to play the do we uh, want to stun this fucker game. And, um. Uh, I don't know if I want to do that. So, okay, he's doing an AoE. That's a big AoE hit. I don't like it. But uh, that's what he's doing. We could do... Armor piercing, I guess. That's a free action, right? Yeah, let's do that. We should have done that in the first turn. That was silly. Oh, well. Then if we do, like, a big boom slam combo... Good armor break there. Uh, 
uh, except mostly re oh, entirely absorbed by shields, so that was kind of a waste. Whoopsie doopsie. Alright, well, I can make sure we do that, and also sever that. Yeah, that'll take care of the rest of the shields. He gets the big AoE. Oh, and that's not even the AoE, really. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. Um, but everybody seems fine. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, that's fine. That went against our, our front runner. That's, that's okay. Okay, now we kind of get to just be like, boom, bam, boom, bam, boom. Do everything that we can. Break them off the timeline there. That's good armor break there. An additional armor break there, so he'd be almost out of armor by the end of this turn. On top of giving us a stun chance if we really want to risk that. Which if we do that, it would have to happen now. <laughs> it has to happen now if we're gonna do that. Um, because he's going first. So let's... Fuck, fuck, whatever. Let's do it. Since we know this isn't permadeath, as long as we make it through the fight, right? Big boom slams all the way around. Okay, there's the tire armor break there. He's on fire. Big boom slam there. 165 is nice. Another 41 from bleeding or something. And he gets to go like that, which is probably fine. Yeah, okay. Oh, he gets to go again. Ouch. Okay, Budget Han Solo takes one on the chin. That's fine. It's the third time. No, stop. Stop it. Come on. Ass. Um, okay, what does he get to do here? All right. Going after our other front runner. It's fine. Um, I guess the strongest attacks we got, right? Not going to get any... Well, you know what? Let's do that. Be like, hey, yeah. Do more damage. Um, do that. And do that. And then we might be able to just. No, not gonna end it there. But. Do most of it, honestly. 4, 67. Either way, we'll get all four. Uh, Crits there. Bonk. And bonk. 101's pretty good from Budget Han Solo. And bonk there, another 107. And also burning, which is great. And then bonk, 88. Oof. It's okay. It's alright. Everybody still lives. I don't think he's gonna get to go... Okay, he's gonna get a free turn here, which is fine. Whatever. Um, and now he's running away or doing whatever, so... There's the kill shot there, no problem. That's gonna do 40, and he's got 105, so maybe we just be like, Yeah, whatever. Deflect and wait on it. Uh, that's gonna do 80-some. He's got 105, so we may as well defend. And defend. We'll let Protag have this one. Big boom slam to, to finish this here. Very good. Good job, everybody. Everybody lives. Everybody lives. 
Except for those dudes, which they fucking die, because whatever. Okay, good job, everybody. Um, let's see, we've got 1 to 115. Alright, so we might get two folks to level 6 here. Yep, just got barely enough. Guard all allies seems pretty fucking good. And also does reflect. And also plus 20% defense. I like that. It's kind of like the weaker version of what we had on the other dude. But I do like place your bets too. Like that one was a very easy choice for his action. Oh. Plus I think that can hit anything on the field. All right, that's probably more valuable right now. But okay, we've got uh, 6665. And we'll pick up another person, I think, right? The Enforcer. Oh, hey, it's the other dude on like the title card. Okay. And the point of the man, you don't know what the presence of mind controlling nanobots in the public water supply also found your man. Oh, god damn it, he's a conspiracy theorist. Son of a bitch! <laughs> uh, deadly and unhinged. <laughs> uh, no. Because the Guardian. Ah, oh, god, I like the Guardian too. I'm familiar with the Guardian's attacks and abilities and shit, so that's. That's fun, but also. Enforcer. Uh, sure. Just, just for variety's sake, I guess, right? Um. What's his stats look like? Oh, he's only—he's got very few. Like he's a back row dipshit, isn't he? Yeah. He's only slightly. Oh man, he's got less health than Budget Han Solo. Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. But he's got an AoE attack once we get to level 8. That's cool. Ah. Uh. Else to regen shields, really? According to what? Got that. Oh, that's he's got a stun attack too. I like that. Okay, so we've got two stunners then. Where's our uh, shield regen stuff? I don't know. Regenerate shields in a pinch, huh? Well, we'll see about that, I guess. Can we give him anything? Do we have anything to give? No, we've got nothing. Oh, this, I guess. Woohoo. Alright, well, you can take our fucking hand-me-down rifle, I guess. It's also level 5. He joins us at level 5. We got 65 bucks. That's not a lot of money. Oh, that's not any money for any of that. About this. Oh yeah, we can't afford anything. Can't afford anything cool. Damn. Well, that makes the decision easy, doesn't it? All right, off we go. Off we go on to area three here. Okay. Well, already got. The combo between um, our commando robot dude and budget Han Solo, right? That's not bad. Can we work anybody else up to a combo here? Who's the closest? Probably... Well, either uh, our Aegis and Protag, or budget Han Solo and Protag. Which I think we know what that does. That's a a single target stun. God, I wish we had some AoE stuff. That's gonna be a problem. Very little AoE, if any. 
Um, but alright, let's try... Okay, armor defense crit damage seems fine, whatever, there we go. Um, can we return the favor there? A little bit. Attacks cause bleeding. Additional crit damage. Okay, I'm into that. We got two points left. Um, attack speed. Shield drain, or do we have two... Okay, we've got two, uh... Two one-poppers here. Damage versus marked. I don't think we have a marking attack, do we? So that's probably worthless. Forbidden knowledge seems fun. Um, or we could do. do we have, okay, we don't have enough points to do the all around, do we? Fortunate. But I do like this one too. Attack speed up is good. Alright. Good enough. Good enough. We'll do the first three actions on. Area 3 here without an issue, right? Okay. Oh, level 8s is not great. Level 8, level 9? Ah. Ah, ha, ha, ho, ho. Not really into that, but we'll fight him when we fight him, I guess. Ugh. A little bit troublesome, all of those, but, uh, we have squad fives. Fives and sixes. Um. Well, I have to make do. Okay, what do we have here? Basic bitch fight there. Oh, they're level sevens already, huh? Huh? Uh, level 7 up there with some equips. Level 7 up there with some money. What's this dude? Level 7 over there. The big fuckers. Okay, there we go. Level 8 there. I don't want to do that right away. 7 there. Level 7 there. Ah, I see. So there's the health bit over there. That might be a good idea to go liberate, huh? One, two, perhaps three over here. That'll give us some extra level up juice. And then day two we can do one... Uh, I guess two here. That'll be level eight. And three here. Oh, eesh. Boy, I don't like that. But, if we need to do it, we need to do it. Practically free stuff over there, unless we do one, two for the free equips there, three for the money up there. And we can probably take that dude fresh on day two, more or less. Um, that area's gonna be locked down. Okay, so one, two, three. Take this dude fresh on day two. One. Uh. Two. Three? Oh, that's a level nine. Gross. Uh, I don't like that. But alright, let's start with. I think that one up to the top right. go this way. Alright, five on four. So numbers already in our favor. They're all pretty slow. Got here. It's a flurry attack. Kinda slow. Can I can only attack the front row. 
Mm. Ah, this one can. That's right. Just place your best can attack. Unfortunately, it's a very low stagger. Okay, here's our new dude, right? Okay, that applies marks. Also have cover fire. And, oh, that also does shield regen. That's interesting. Okay. It's no stagger. He does no stagger. Except for this, which does stun. Interesting. Alright. I'm sure at least these dudes back here can get pounded off the timeline here. Except for that dude. That dude's gonna get to go. They're all attacking my frontline tank anyways, so let's do that. Uh, well, actually with that in mind, let me do a stronger attack with her. Ah, uh, no, I can't. Sunder is really the only one that I can attack the back row with. We're kind of on our... our own with these other things. If we do straight shot there, and then first shot, second, that's not gonna kill him. We just may as well guarantee that he's getting pushed off until next turn, then. <sighs> I guess guarantee that he's probably gonna go down first next round, anyways. damage and the rest of his shield there. Just take one on the chin there a little bit. <clears throat> Alright, now it's going to be a bit of a problem. It's the front. Okay, that dude's the front one. I don't like him doing that. Me not have you do that? Who can attack him in the back row there? Nobody. Oh, not quick enough to not have him do something at any rate. Okay. Well, assuming that he goes then. Do a little bit of health damage. It sucks. We could then... Cover fire our friend here. Defense increased by 15%. I don't know that that matters. I've never seen that defense increase actually do anything. That's fine. That guy to get murdered right away, too. Oh, actually, hold on a second. There, there. No, wait, where's my... I thought I had her stop that. There. Okay, there's the kill shot there. Uh, who is the other one I really need to worry about? Not that one, clearly. Here. That one there. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do anything with that. Make sure he goes away right away, then that should 
unlock pretty much the entire back row, right? So what does that do? That's 37 plus 27, and this dude has 15. Okay, so he's essentially toast no matter what we do. Let's get him out of here, just so it unlocks the rest of the back row there. Okay, now we can maybe work out... Oh no, we can still can't fucking do anything about this, huh? Well, that dude's gonna die anyways. And whoever's gonna eat that one. And that one, maybe, right? So, okay. At least two of these three fuckers are gonna die. That guy's toast. This dude's probably not long, either. Yeah, there goes his armor. And then, boom, 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 bam, right? Okay, oh, he gets to take a knock first. He gets to go, but then boom, 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 boom. Okay, that's fine. I think we're gonna have a problem with any of this, really. Just have folks do their quickest, lightest attacks. Everybody's dead, pretty much, right? Yep, that dude's gone. And then that dude's gone. <laughs> so really, just budget Han Solo taking a real light tap there. Everybody else is fine. Okay, now we could get whatever fire's gonna be. It's just a normal-ass attack, pierces armor, fire's burning. Seem bad. Um, or pull everybody guard here. Not opposed to either. But I do like him getting additional armor break and even a stagger out of that, so yeah, sure. Hi. And our opened up option here is this fucker here, which he's guarding some equipment. Not much. And then the other, probably the third act, is gonna be down there. Okay, so now it's five on five. Hooray! Ah, oh, they got a guard dipshit in there too. Great. Ugh. Okay, well, who's attacking who? They really hate Budget Han Solo for some reason. But most of the rest of them are attacking the front line. Also have access to our... ...combo move, which is gonna be like... ...almost murder one dude immediately. Might not be a bad idea, we'll think about it. We have anything else that can hit the back line there. Did that plus uh, that? That kill? Oh, what? Okay. Probably make sure that. Frontline dipshit goes down in one. And if not, from direct attacks from burning, probably. He doesn't attack this round, which is even better. Okay, into that. We 
good attack there. That'll be a you know, slight problem, whatever. Okay, yeah, there goes that guy, no problem. Now, however... <laughs> Fuck. That guy's gonna get to go, I think, no matter what. Unless we do a stun. Which we can do... Here, right? Oh, but that only fucking goes... Uh, against the front row, which might be actually important there. You just murder him outright, because that takes 20, and this takes 15. Might as well just get rid of him, right? Although that eats two people's turns instead of just the one. Ah, fuck it. Whatever. Let's just get him out of here. Fuck it. Alright, now it'll be a matter of uh, doing the correct thing in the correct order. Uh, I'd like to push that guy back first if I can. Oh, I'm just probably just gonna murder him outright anyways, yeah? Which I don't think that's, yeah, that's not gonna push him. Not gonna push him off the timeline, which all of them now are focusing down there. Oh, that's gonna take way too much, so... Uh, okay, there we go, that's better. So let's get one of them off the timeline a little bit. Don't worry about the rest. Oh, just murder him straight out. Oh, nope, coming in. Kinda into that, too! One shot there, just what, 100, whatever, we'll take it. And boom, 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 boom. Out of there, and then that'll be 22 health out of there regardless. She doesn't have health steel anymore, it's armor steel. Oh, it's a kill shot anyway. Don't worry about focusing down this dipshit. That's gonna be the end of it, no matter what. And big boom slam to finish it, right? Excellent. Okay, good stuff. Our last level six level up there, and three equips. Maybe I should have opened this before doing the level up. Considering, ah, yeah, of course. Ooh, especially that. My goodness, regen plus shields plus armor defense. Anybody can take that. Uh, well. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, 
I think I'm gonna have to grab that, and then whoever gets the, the level 7 level up first gets to have this. Alright, so then our choice is, well, let's go murder that level 7 one easy right there, or do that one and get the money. Equipment down there, and money up there. Uh, I think I need this one first, because then we'll be fresh on day two to go hit the big boy down south. Okay, five on four, no problem. Hmm. Okay, it's just that dude, so we can probably just avoid hitting him altogether. It's essentially free. Boy, they are really focusing down, uh, budget Han Solo there. Well, oh, change that. do that, and then we'll do whatever attacks we need to do here. There. That'll break three of the four off of this timeline, right? Turn fire on it. That's interesting. Okay, whatever. Thirty seven is real good, plus burning. Excellent. I don't like that. <laughs> Oh, I don't like that at all. Uh, can I do anything about that? Get him off the field entirely. Two of them off the field entirely, really. And then. Attack who? Is that? Let's do deflect. And whatever else happens here is just gonna do whatever, right? Cause boom, he's off the timeline, whatever. This guy's dead, right? Ouch. But also, he takes a tap on the chin from the reflective damage. He's now burning, and this guy's dead. Regardless, right? Then this guy gets to do whatever he's doing. I don't know what he's doing. Ouchie. Oh, ow. That's a pretty big hit. Whoops. I didn't pay attention to that, apparently. Yeesh. Okay. Well, what can we do here? Is 
they're gonna return fire. Which, I don't know who is best to maybe eat one of those to ensure. Because he'll do another counterattack too, I think. Or does that not proc on. Uh, can we not like anti counter stuff? Alright, well, I think we do like some delayed stuff here. Wait for them to not be doing this. Or guarantee that we're gonna get a kill on one of these. Because what does that do? Like, it doesn't tell me how much it's gonna. Okay, just three armor damage essentially. But I'm gonna get four armor back anyway, so whatever. Oh, wait, hold on a second. If I'm gonna do that, I should do the, the one that has armor to get. Cause that'll give me armor back. <laughs> All right, fuck you then. Um, just defend for the rest of everybody else, right? Unless we can guarantee that there's gonna be a a kill on one of these. Also, give me some uh, shield back, I guess, too, huh? Pretty good. So they'll do the counter attack there? No? No, huh? Okay, well, I think either way we're probably pretty good here. <laughs> Don't think they'll be able to do anything to us. dude's toast, and then we've got two additional attacks going out, so this dude's gonna be toast. Probably right here, huh? Oh, maybe not. There. Problem. Extra, extra, extra money there. And now, we get to level up, so... Okay, who's gonna get that Level 7, whatever the fuck it is. Uh, maybe not our Protex, which has got a weaker version of it already. But I think anybody else can use it. So maybe our other Frontliner? That'll give armor, plus shield regen, plus something else, right? So, yeah, let's give her the level up. And she gets the fun. Additional shield capacity, too. Oh, yeah. Fucking brutal. Alright. Great. Good there. Um, and now we get a few extra little little bops as we go around. Alright. Is that the only extra thing we've got here? Yeah. Okay, not bad though. Not bad at all. And a little campy bit, and we're at the end of the night the way it is anyway, so uh, we'll call it there. We'll call it there, and then start fresh on day two of Area 3 next time. Seems good, seems good. Okay, cool. Well, pretty productive. Nobody died, nobody really took a massive hit. We got some level ups, some equipment, all that cool shit. So we'll be good to go when we start this next time. So that'll do it for tonight. Next stream will be Wednesday night, 7 p.m. CDT. Back to Star Renegades here. Uh, Thursday, 7.30 p.m. CDT will be Shmup Book Club. 
So uh, Ginga Force and Universe are still going, and then Ginga something 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 Sapphire is still going as the monthly. Um, I don't remember the entire name of it, but that could be coming up on Thursday. Friday, Saturday, we're off, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT will be more long play. So more Talos Principle 2 of the uh, hardest puzzles of the DLC that we need to finish off. Maybe we'll finish it off uh, on Sunday. Who knows? Who knows? But that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you on Wednesday. Bye-bye.